What's going on, Hit Squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back. I need like a explosion when I say that. Like I am back. <laughs> What's going on? I'm back, and this is your main man, Hitman, and I. I'm back once again with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Online. This is for. The family heirlooms, all luxury, the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Sunday, November 7th, and as I say each and every video, make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, turn on all post notifications so you can get each and every video that I put out. Because I put out videos, um, I guess at this point, it's like whenever I feel like it. <laughs> now, I try to put them out, you know each and every day sometimes i get cold, get a cold or sick or something like that my voice messes up and then i just have to take a break it's just like a whole mental situation a physical situation and that's what happens anywho let's not make this video super long by me babbling let's get to hear what you guys are here for which are the cycles i know it's kind of early um or you may feel like it's early, but this is right on time. The si the time changed in, I guess, some states. I don't think it's like a, a, a worldwide thing. It doesn't do it everywhere. But the time change in the videos are now from uh, 7 p.m. to 7 p.m. The cycles change every day at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. That's New York time zone, East Coast time zone, for those of you, of you who don't know. Or not of America. I personally forgot myself. And I, my alarm, I set my alarm last night. Like, what's this alarm for? And it said, do the video. So, here I am. <laughs> um, But back into what I was saying. The cycles change every day from 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to 7 p.m. And then I'll drop another video and Madame Nazar changes at 1 a.m. now. So everything is an hour earlier. Just so you guys know, I will put that in the description and in the name of the video and all that stuff. So just so you guys know, um, let's get to everything, which today, if you've been looking at the map, Madame Nazar, look, Madame Nazar is down by Manzanita Post right here in the Great Plains area, right outside of Blackwater right here at this location she will be here until 1 a.m that's eastern standard time new york time zone east coast time zone for those of you who don't know or not of america how i personally get to her when she's at this location is i simply fast travel to manzanita post which is should put you right outside this house which i think is like right here that's where the fast travel is but sometimes i spawn down here like down in this area but once i do get there i just take the um, take the road and go right around that bend and go to our location. Super simple. Do it how you need to do. Go cut through the forest if you want to. Make it a little spicy. You know what I'm saying? You want to add a little uh, spontaneous to your situation. <laughs> um, let's get to the next thing, which is the Caribbean Rum Antique Alcohol Bottle, which I clicked off of where it was, but today it's in Van Horn Trading Post right here on this boat. Go on to the boat, go up to the second level of the boat, and that's where you will find your uh, antique alcohol bottle for today, your Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle, which as I tell you guys, this bottle is part of a collection and you can use it as a recipe or part of a recipe for your moonshine shack wherever you have it around the map. Let's get down to here to where we um, normally do business, which is the Lemoyne area of the map. Today, the cycles or the cycles for today, Sunday, November 7th are, I feel like I, I had too much to drink, so I'm not flowing my words normally. Um, <laughs> not alcohol drink, like just regular drinks. Um, the cycles for today, Sunday, November 7th, are Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Luxury Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 1, Arrowhead Cycle 6, Wildflower Cycle 5, 
And take out Call Bottle Cycle 6, All Terra Card Cycle 5, Bird Egg Cycle 4, and Fossil Cycle 3. Remember to check the description box below because I will put everything down there. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and Cash App for the channel. Um, that's just in case you guys do want to connect with me on any other social media and or donate to the channel in any type of way. Uh, it's there. Uh, let's get to these things that we will find across the map that I have marked down real quick. Let's starting with this marker here, right here at this location, you guys will get a fossil. This fossil is randomized. I cannot tell you what it is right here. This lo location come over here with your metal detector. And that's what you will hit on a random fossil It's right about right here. I feel like it's right there. <laughs> so do just come over in this area. I feel like if you do come in the area, if you if you've been collecting, you should know what a spot looks like. M maybe there's a tree that you go near or a, a clear spot in the grass or something like that, you know. <laughs> but come over here with your metal detector, and that's what you will dig up a random fossil right here inside this burned down house on a barrel you guys will get a ten of wands if you do come over here and grab that let's go over to our next fo uh, marker i was gonna say fossil right here by the word lakay right here at this l-shaped shack right towards the back you guys will get a family heirloom which is a goat hairbrush right here on a bench that's where your goat hairbrush sits inside that house let's go over to the left a little bit more where this item is in the chimney of this house. Approach the chimney and you should get a prompt to search it. And you will dig or pull out a Durant Pearl bracelet. It's inside the chimney. All you have to do is walk up to it. Uh, when that's there, there's also a lost jury at the back of the house or outside the house. There's a very large tree. Go near the stump of that large tree or the base of that large tree with your metal detector and that's what what you will pull out or dig up another random lost jewelry there's also a tarot card on this dock here if you guys want to go get that too that's a page of pentacles across the way if you do want to cross the water or even go all the way around right here at this location of this marker you guys will get a coin this coin is randomized i cannot tell you what it is because it's randomized over here near this moonshine shack across the Kamasa River once again. I think at the back there is a cardinal flower and on the side there's a tarot card which is an eight of wands. So go and get that. Go and get all that. Why not? Right here at our next marker along this kind of along the shoreline or whatever. Right here at this location, you guys will get a heron egg. That's H-E-R-O-N. It's in a tree. Shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Let's go over here to... Matter of fact, let's go up a little bit right here in this little gazebo. Or I wouldn't call it a little gazebo. Right here on the map, it looks little. Right here in this gazebo, you guys will get a six of wands tarot card. And another tarot card for you is all the way over here on the other side of the map, right here in front of this church. On a bench, you guys will get a two of Pentacles tarot card. Let's go down a little bit more by the D and the knee. Right here at this location, you guys will get an ivory hairpin. I cannot tell you what. Um, I don't know why I wanted to say that, but... <laughs> You don't have to dig for this or anything like that. This is a ivory hairpin. It's a family heirloom. It's right on the table on the other side of this brick wall right here. Just go through the gate. You should see the table right there. Just grab it off. Super simple. Let's go down to our next location or our next marker. Right here in the backyard of this house. On a table, you guys will get a cherry wood comb. It's like patio furniture right along the... The house right here and it's right on the table of you know the patio furniture let's go down to our next marker which is another car uh cardinal flower is another fossil right here at this location 
uh, it's a random file, so I cannot tell you what it is because it is randomized. Go right here to this location with your metal detector in this little sewage area. There's a skeleton down there and all kinds of other stuff. You won't, don't worry about getting harmed or anything. Just go down there with your metal detector right here to this location, and that's what you will dig up a random fossil. While you are down there, go over here to this location of this next marker, which is the cardinal flower that spawns over here in this area each and every day and by its exact location. It tells me exactly what cycle the flowers are on for today, and today is cycle five. Let's go down to our next marker, which is a antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is a Irish whiskey bottle. This Irish whiskey bottle is inside a boat next to a skeleton or a broken down boat like on along the little shoreline right here. Come over here. You don't need your metal detector or anything like that. Just grab it out the boat and keep it pushing. On to our next marker or not even marker, just to another location. Um, I do want to tell you guys about something that's in the Braithwaite Manor home, which I usually try to tell you guys something that's in here too, or lately. There's a jade hairpin on top of the fireplace, second floor, first room to the left, inside the Braithwaite Manor home. So go and grab that. This next marker is my last marker, but I have do have others for you right here at this location. There's a coin. This coin is randomized. I cannot tell you what it is but it's at the base of a dead tree. This dead tree is sticking out of the ground and there's two dead trees laying on the ground. The one that's sticking out of the ground with no tree, no leaves or anything like that on it. Go to the base of that tree with your metal detector and that's what you will get, a random coin. I have a couple tarot cards for you guys, which one is in this barn here. On the work table, you guys will get a two of pentacles. And up here, at this hanging platform on the railing, you guys will get a Three of Swords tarot card as well. There's also a Six of Pentacles at the back of this house on a wagon. There's a family heirloom inside this house. It's a New Guinea Rosewood hairbrushes in a chest in one of the bedrooms. And right up here at this location, on this little island part, pull out your metal detector and you guys will get a random coin, another random coin. That's pretty much it for all the extras and stuff that I do have for you guys. I hope that you can see everything or you you follow, you know, at least to see if you if that's what you wanted to do. Um, the cycle for today, Sunday, November 7th, once again are Family Heirloom Cycle 4. All Luxury Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 1, Arrowhead Cycle 6, Wildflower Cycle 5, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 6, All Terror Card Cycle 5, Bird X Cycle 4, and Fossils Cycle 3. Remember to check the description box below because everything, everything that I've talked about in the video, or more or less, not Madame Nazar's location or anything like that, but any information that I could put down there, I put down there for you guys. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and cash out for the channel. Thank you guys for watching once again with another video. Remember, the everything will be an hour earlier now. Uh, the videos should drop a little bit after 7, and, or a little bit after 7 and before 8 if I can help it. Um, and Madame Nazar will change at 1 a.m. And I will try to, you know, post her new location on social media. That's Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. If you haven't followed me, look me up. Every, the information is down in the description box below. It's your main man, Hitman, with another video. Once again, I don't know why I did the finger guns, but I'm out.